Thank you all so much for having me here tonight and welcoming me. I am Cynthia, and my son um, EJ is about the most incredible little boy in the world. I am a little biased, but his laugh, uh, especially his belly laugh, um, is the best music to my ears. His smile just takes your breath away, and I'm so proud of him. Um, no matter how many mountains he's had, he has the pure will of a lion. And um, <laughs> I'm just so proud of him. Um, he uh, holds a diagnosis of autism, a primary diagnosis. Um, we're so blessed that our journey began with Easter Seals in 2016. He has received um, the most incredible therapy from the most incredible therapist. And uh, it has been life changing for him. And one of the most important things that Easter Seals has taught us is that even though he carries the diagnosis of autism, it doesn't have to define him. And that is super powerful and we are so thankful. Um, we are just so incredibly uh, blessed and thankful to have been introduced into the Instride family. Um, EJ, just to give you a little bit of a background, he is generally a very cautious child. You're not going to see him flying through the air on playground equipment. Um, he struggled with uh, depth perception. Um, so on our way to our first uh, in-stride session, super excited, told him you're going to get to ride a horse and it's going to be amazing. And um, he was like, because we try our best to prepare him, uh, he does well with that. And he was like, well, mommy, I will go out and look, but I am not going to be riding any horses today. And I was like, okay. If I tend to push him, he goes in the other direction. And um, so we get out here, and he sees Grace, and it is love at first sight. And he got right on her, and it was uh, absolutely incredible. Um, it was about a month into uh, his writing here at Instride that we started to see a gradual change in his uh, sensory seeking behaviors. Um, EJ was engaging in a lot of uh, head swinging, hand flapping, and uh, tippy toe walking. And um, you know, we, st we saw what we thought was gradual, but it wasn't until he missed a week of writing from being sick. And those behaviors we saw had about a 60% increase. And my husband, he was like, not to quote the monkeys, but I am a believer. He was just floored, as was I. It was absolutely incredible. And then I truly started to understand the sensory input that um, he's getting when he's writing, which is really incredible. Incredible. Uh, we have seen such an improvement in EJ's language, his speech, his phonemic awareness, um, his articulation, which is uh, flowing over into so many areas of his life, his ability to communicate, uh, make friends, um, do well in school, which uh, has been a real blessing. Um, he absolutely loves Here at Instride as well, that uh, you know their approach to also teaching him is through fun which is uh, great and he um, he has an amazing therapist here too Miss Carly she is phenomenal with him and um, <laughs> and um, she always takes a moment to talk to me see how I'm doing with him you know the work that we're doing at home the carryover it's uh, been incredible one of the most beautiful gifts that I have seen in EJ is uh, his improved confidence. He is believing in himself and he has a willingness to try things that he has been hesitant to before. So as his mom, that is one of the coolest, most amazing things that I can see in him too. Um, also too, uh, he loves all the horses that he rides. Um, especially, he has a special bond with uh, Grace. It has evoked his curiosity about horses, um, you know, where she lives, who takes care of her, what she eats, and so on. Um, so also, too, you know, just on the speech and kind of building off of that, um, he, you know, we would talk about what a blessing it is to ride Grace and that it is, it's expensive to take care of horses and to really appreciate his time that he has out here. And uh, he's like, well, mommy, do you think I could maybe earn some money for Grace? And I'm like, absolutely. So one week, all of his uh, chores he did, 
he earned five dollars for grace and he went and took it to the office and he was so incredibly proud that he worked hard and uh, had had a part in uh, help, helping you know I think we all might have uh, what we would consider our, our own interpretation of a miracle and to me in my humble opinion watching my son learn to communicate to articulate uh, to be able to succeed in this world while writing this beautiful majestic creature that's helping him with his sensory input um, in my opinion is nothing short of a miracle I um, I want to say thank you so so much to Easter seals to in stride to the sponsors the donors and uh, most of all I want to say thank you to the therapists and the volunteers who have devoted your lives to um, empowering uh, adults and children with special needs in our community um, I can tell you with EJ you are making a difference and um, I am one mother who will be forever, forever thankful.